actors in 2010 don't act as well as 2021 because we know more now. Men, stop that. Stop that. Acting has not gotten any better. Hey, <laughs> hey. Like, acting is you know acting. what? If you're convincing in 2009, you, know you should be convincing for, in 2021. For example, at one time in, in life, people thought this was funny. Ooh, Jalu, putting pops, and oh, man, that's hilarious. You're good. You do that now, I'm like, man, that's not funny. That was oh, Bill Cosby. That was 1979. Hey, hey, okay. And people like Pee Wee Herman. He, he, he was People an actor. still like Pee Wee Herman. He was an actor. I don't know who. He was an, he was an actor. Oh, man, Pee Wee. <laughs> you watch Pee Wee's Playhouse and watch... <laughs> and, and, and tell, Dog, there's, uh, he uh, has a, a, like, a, like a special or something on Netflix. We we don't like it no more. I, like, as a baby, you might have liked it. I even say that about the original acting. Man, I don't want to go there, but the original acting in Coming to America. Like, certain things were funny, yeah, but when you really look at it, was Sam Yage, was that really good acting? Well, like, no. No, no, no. Dog, we, you no. don't want to do Coming to America. No. Because no, I mean. Coming to America, the first one, was ten times better than the second one. Because you remember. And That's like It's not about the, the nostalgia. It's about the fact that James Earl Jones seemed like a king throughout that movie. He seemed like a joke for about 15 minutes that he knew he was a part of. Like, let me just go ahead and play with these people. Like. His his acting was, in the second one was way worse. That than was this job he did in the first. One. That was their way of connecting the first movie to the second. Because you got to think about it. at least sixty percent of people that viewed the second movie had never seen the first movie. Honestly, like I mean, I mean, we watched together in the house with, with kids who had never saw them in America. They had heard of it. They might saw glimpses of it, but never really watched it like we watched it. Like really watch it five six times. I saw Coming to America in the movie. So you, so you telling me in the movie theater? You telling me that just keeping James Earl Jones, just keeping him in the movie, is not enough of a connection. We got to make him act silly. He died. He died, but he died by saying, "I'm going to die now." Like that is not, that is not good. That is that's a joke that you know you're a part of. In in the, in the original movie, you had the whole uh, come out on the balcony and like. You know, he cussing out, Eric, yeah, and that was that was hilarious. Yes. No, it really wasn't. Okay. But I mean, but no, but it really wasn't. Okay. But we laughed at. It. Look, the story that they telling was better in the first one because you had a fish out of water and Akeem. You constantly referenced the mopping scene. <clears throat> Why would he mop like that, standing up smiling like that's not funny? Mm -hmm. Okay, it's not funny to you now after twenty years of seeing it or thirty years of seeing it, however long it was, but. The reason why it was good acting then is because if you take a real prince and you put him in a McDonald's and you tell him to work, I got you. he's going to do stupid stuff like that right. because he's never cleaned anything. That's good acting. See, you have to, okay, I would never say Eddie Murphy's not a great actor. It was a great movie. One of the best. you just telling me top, that. One of the top movies ever made. Okay. My point is, when it comes down to acting, actors weren't held to the same things that they held to nowadays they were able to get away with patented things eddie murphy from eddie murphy had a certain way he'd act or sing or do something in every movie to show off some of the things that he can do that was every, his style yeah that was his style okay. and it was accepted almost like mr kevin hart now you know what i mean you like to do this it, you know you know what i'm saying it, it's just <laughs> that just that you know like it's okay to use it maybe not the best coming to america one was the was was the best all right but Coming to America 2 had better parts. What about nothing about Coming to America 2 was better than anything from Coming to America 1? This is, this is, this is. <laughs> Give me this something. Is, this is the base. This, <laughs> like the whole, the whole way that, uh, that uh, he didn't know he had a son. He didn't know he had a son because. Trash. Like, because, <laughs> because we saw that, that great acting scene from the front. Hi, we're twins. And, and, and Arsenio Hall, who was a great actor. Back then, spits oh, the water out. Oh, all right, all right. <laughs> so anyway, so then he spits the water out, and now you go all these years later, and they show a backstory from that, because when, when you know I, what the, you know what the word for that is that? it's called retconning. Okay, like you go back and you change things, right? Okay, you you gave us a scene in which we saw the whole night play out, mm -hmm. and now you're telling us, oh no, it didn't happen quite like that. This happened, Amen. and he didn't even remember that. Hey, come on, man. As a guy, as a guy that that that, that got drunk and, and and maybe done things I don't remember, <laughs> good things can happen, man. <laughs> I ain't got no children though. <laughs> yeah, exactly. You, you probably remember that. 
how did we get here? How did we get on, on this? I don't know. We started no, talking about. We was talking about the acting in Dawn of the yeah. Dead versus the acting in in Army of the Dead. Yeah. I think that's I, it. I think we're good. I think we're good on the it, video. But we could do this. That's great. We could do this all the time, <laughs> all the time. <laughs> a summertime too. I ain't got nothing to do. Get early.